found dead inside a home near 25th and Atkinson. 12 News' Shanae Amara spoke to the child's family who explained why police call his death suspicious. Well, the investigation started at this home here behind me where that little boy lived and where his grandmother says she can't get her grandbaby's lifeless body out of her mind. When we found him, he was laying on a bed. His face was swollen oh and his mouth was open. And so we and he said that my grandbaby fell. It don't look like he fell. Mm -hmm. Look like he beat him. Right now, this grandmother is grieving. Octavia Galligan tells me she hasn't slept since finding her grandson, Alonzo Lamar Jr., unresponsive. My grandbaby gone, and I just want him to know, why did you do it? She says her daughter, the boy's mother, is completely heartbroken, but that she's also pregnant and trying to keep her head on straight for her unborn child. She going through it right now. She's asleep. I had to just make her go to sleep. The baby's mother tells me her ex-boyfriend was babysitting Alonzo while she was at work, and police say he turned himself in early Thursday morning. Now the family says they just want justice. And why? We just need to know so we can bury him right. In Milwaukee, Sharnay Amara, WISN 12 News. An autopsy was scheduled for today to figure out how the child died.